So Jason, yes. in your hand I've put this new uh, gadget that I was sent by new, my new friend Lee. This is the um, speed flea. And uh, I don't think there are many other companies that do this type of thing, but this will tell us maximum speed of your Avanti when we get it in the air. Yeah. And it's, it's GPS, it's not, um, it's not, not true, air true air speed, but it's ground speed, right? Let's be clear on Absolutely, that. Absolutely, yeah. Before somebody. But it'll give us a pretty good idea. It. Within, I mean, there's barely any wind today, so I mean, we should be within, so very within close, a couple of miles now. Very hour. close yeah, to yeah. what air speed would be anyway. Yeah, absolutely. So yeah. it's it's nice in that it, it, it plugs directly into two cells, or you get a little extension so you can plug it into any other balance plug. So if you plug it into your what six cell pack? It is a six S pack, yeah. Then you just have to wait for it to um, find the satellites when it's on board GPS, and then we're ready to go. There we go. So, telling me the pack voltage. Yeah, it tells you that as well. It tells you the. Uh, it's a battery checker as well. And now it's, really it's saying, please wait for the satellites. So. But let's give it a couple of minutes and see once it's got satellites. Yeah, it should take about, he said, 20 to 30 seconds to pick okay. up the satellites, GPS satellites, and then we'll be ready to go. Cool. Right, so Jason, before you get going, yes. let's have a guess. How fast do you think this will be, ground speed? Ground speed, I reckon 94 miles an hour. 94? Yeah, I will go guess. for 87. Okay, this is the uprated one, which I think they claim can reach 100, but... Maybe with a down, downward wind and a bit of a dive, but let's see. All right, let's see. Right, so I've zoomed out. So we can see the ground. Here he comes. That was a downwind pass. The wind has picked up now. So obviously the high speed is going to be a downwind pass. Oh, he's got some real height. You're going to turn and burn? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he wants it to go as fast as possible. Here we go. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's quick. It's not. It's not blistering quick, but it's fairly quick. Yeah, one more hot one. Push it, push it. <laughs> He's climbing. Oh my god. Will it go over a hundred? <laughs> where, where are you going? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> He's addicted now. Bit of height. Maximum zoom. <laughs> Will he get over 100 miles an hour? All right. He's going to bring it in for land and uh, then we'll see. Suspense is killing me, Don. <laughs> Shall we have a look at what the Whatever you do, is? don't turn it off. <laughs> and I'm not going to point the camera at it because it won't pick up the LCD, but... Well, according to this, 153 miles per hour. No way! <laughs> really? That's what it says. Oh my God! <laughs> So it I says 153.28 miles an hour was the top speed. Blimey! So 
We'll, uh, we'll do another run to confirm it. Wow! I've got a couple of packs. I'm but amazed by that. If it, if it really is 150. You know, if that's 153, what, how fast is my turbine version of the Avanti going to go? Doing, that's doing another 50 miles an hour at least. <laughs> I, reckon, yeah. I wouldn't have thought of fame you'll do over 200. Well, I'm impressed. Well, and it is accurate, you know, it's. Uh, you know, he's done a lot of testing on this thing. And actually, in the newer version that customers are going to buy, it's going to have maximum altitude as well. Yeah. I mean, that, they were some pretty steep dives from quite high speed. Man, they so, were, yeah. you were out of zoom range. Yeah, it was, uh, maybe we'll do a straight and level flight next time and see. Yeah, and, that and would be interesting, the comparison, wouldn't absolutely, it? Absolutely, yeah. All so, right, so uh, thanks change. for watching. The link to the speed flea that um, my friend Lee is producing this amazing little unit that will go in so many models. It weighs nothing. It weighs nothing. It will go in, you know, he actually originally designed it for surface, so for cars, uh, well, for boats, actually. He's into boats but it applies to cars and will enter air models as, as well. And he's going to put in three modes, it will support three modes um, for those and for rockets, because <laughs> rockets want to know That's cool. vertical airspeed. He's going to do that. So there'll be a rocket, air, aero and surface mode, I think, and it will do maximum altitude as well. So a fantastic little gadget and it doesn't cost a lot of money. So the link for this is in the video description and the pinned comment. Look up the price, I think you'll be amazed. He's a very innovative guy and he's going to be bringing out some cool stuff in the near future. Look out for it on Essential RC. Thanks Jason, no great problem. demo. Here he comes. Here we go. Will he get over a hundred miles an hour? <laughs>